Hey everyone, this is Kunal from Digit and today I have the LG G Pro 2 with me. Uh, it's uh, the company's flagship smartphone uh, aimed at tablet users. Uh, this was launched at about 51,500 and now you can get in the market for around 39,000 which is quite uh, a big drop for uh, such a big smartphone. Uh, this has a really uh, neat design. Uh, you know, you can also use a lot of features on the devices. So you, as you can see, there are no uh, buttons around it. You only get what LG has been uh, doing recently. Uh, the, there are keys underneath the camera, the volume and the power and lock key. You can also use this key for uh, taking pictures. Um, in this uh, price segment, it uh, it is actually a very good deal. And uh, if you you know if you're looking at competitors like uh, Samsung or uh, even Sony, uh, this is actually a very well priced tablet. Uh, you get the Snapdragon 800 processor on it, uh, a 30 megapixel camera with an uh, OIS uh, image stabilization uh, image stabilization system. Uh, the body is pretty neat. There's a 5.5 inch uh, Full HD display on it and the colors and the brightness level on the display are actually very good. Uh, and LG has been very good with its UI as well. This is running on the latest Android KitKat update and it has LG's Optimus uh, UI on it. Uh, so this is actually a very very neat looking tablet which you can get at about you know 40 grand if you have the budget. So not a bad option if you are you know if you like large screen phones and you know you tend to uh, Know, love large screen phones with a with a lot of power on it so this is actually a very good option